Hey guys, a short video about what my wife just bought me. Uh, she got me this uh, heart cordless battery uh, 40 volt uh, weed whacker. It also came with a weed blower. Uh, the weed blower works fantastic. Uh, as long as it's fully charged, uh, it, it works really good. Uh, uh, just now trying out this weed whacker a little bit. Uh, thought I was having issues with the... Uh, the string here but uh i really wasn't so i just wanted to show you guys uh if you ever need to change this out uh you will push these little tabs in which is two on both sides right you will push those in and it'll pop that out all right so that's how you get to your string your string uh it just comes out sorry i know i got it looped around and it pulls through this hole right here all right so when you running it, you don't want it to be in these little notches right here. This is just more for storing so it won't come unraveled, okay? Now, I went ahead and unraveled it because I wanted to see that there's like a little hole right there. Uh, and that's where you will uh, put your new string in there and uh, ravel it back up. So you will put that inside there. And as you notice, I strung it in there. And then you can see it coming out through this side. So there is two ports for that. There's one on this side as well. But I did this. So once you got that in there like that, you can start uh, raveling it back up. So that's what I'm going to do. Now, once you have it wind back up, it should look sort of like this. And you can kind of tell uh, which side goes where. So this will be... Uh, the bottom piece and this will be the part that you will insert back into the weed whacker so uh, you want to find this little hole right here and you want to string it in there now once you have a string through there you want to put this part back inside here all right and make sure you don't get your wire uh, stuck underneath there now, once you have it inside there, it should look sort of like this. Now, one thing I wanted to show you, if you can see up here, there's a spring. All right. So whenever you push this button right there, uh, this is how you can feed some more out. All right. Um, it normally does it on its own with the momentum. But if you ever needed to feed any more, you can just push this button right here and pull the string. It's kind of hard to do this with one hand. And it will release some more wire if need to. And then if you need to rewind, just like it says, you would just back this back up. So that is just a quick video on how to uh, put your line back in and your lithium 40 volt weed whacker uh, that you get from Walmart. Uh, like I said, they work really good on um, the battery life. Uh, it's pretty sustainable. I will say that It'll at least get the job done. Um, but you might have to charge it a little bit. Make sure it's fully charged before you do your weed whacking. With your blower, not so much. It can be battery don't have to be fully charged. But that weed whacker, you definitely want it fully charged. So uh, that's just a quick tutorial on how to load your weed whacker. And uh, I'm about to go out here and do this yard.